from Sugar House in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. This is Poker Night in America. Welcome to Poker Night in America. I'm your host, Chris Hansen. For this episode, we're back at Sugar House in Philadelphia for more of our ladies only cash game, which so far has shown us a lot of cordial player interaction among friends. She's a laced with a lot of crushing poker that I wouldn't wish on my worst enemy. These women have been dishing out financial abuse with the grace and poise not often found among their male counterparts. But let's get to the table to see if they can continue to keep their cool. As ladies night continues, we have a new player sitting down in seat four. It's Nancy Levin buying in for $5,000. As you can see, look at Samantha Abernathy. All that money in front of her. She's already up over $15,000. Here's Sugar House. Blinds are 25 and 50 at our cash game. And we have a straddle on the button. So small blind will be first. Hold the blinds fold. Quickly over to Samantha Abernathy. Three twenty-five is the bet. And we're around to the straddle, and Jessica Dolly looks down to pocket sevens. Calls Samantha Abernathy's raise, and so we're heads up for our first hand here tonight on Poker Night in America. Now I feel like I need a drink again. Abernathy missed, but she's going to fire a continuation bet. So far at this table, Samantha Abernathy has been absolutely running over the competition hitting cards whenever she needed to and getting players to fold winning hands. It looks like she's gonna continue the pressure. Jessica Dolly going nowhere. We start the night with over 3K in the pot and just like she's been doing all ladies night long, Samantha Abernathy Pulls ahead at the last possible minute. And it's now 1300 on the river. Are you done with wine? Falling asleep. <laughs> I you like are? Wine makes me fall asleep. Oh. I should have had coffee. Vodka. Oh, yeah. I know. I was, now. Vodka right I, was, I was thinking about it, but I don't want to get it right. You can order some coffee to the table, probably. See if Dolly can make the right decision here to just throw okay. the cards away. I'll go crazy with you. <laughs> and she does. Don't and once again, out. it's You're Samantha playing. Abernathy with just pure magic at our ladies' guys, night table. Do you guys want to play around of truth or dare? Like the, the loser of the hand gets to ask the winner, truth or dare? <laughs> oh, so it's like a consolation. Oh, I know. Yeah. Truth is scary. Okay. Hey. You don't have to have a cry. <laughs> yeah. Beth, we've already seen you with your clothes off. It's okay. Well, no, you've seen me in like lingerie, right. not with my clothes off. <laughs> I am not gonna make. Well, you guys, can't, we're not on a cable station. I can't get naked, right? <laughs> you can do whatever no, you notice, want. Notice how the guys say anything. <laughs> I like that that's that even a consideration. <laughs> All right, Beth Shack, I'll give you a dare. How I dare you to look at your cards? Let's get going here. Oh, okay, I, I haven't even looked at my cards. They're bad. <laughs> Truth or dare? Truth. Truth. <laughs> I'm afraid to say dare. Okay. Jennifer Ooh. Shahadi raises to 150 with a suited ace jack. No, no you dare. Wanna, you just I take that, that, against I take that back. Me. I'm saying dare. So you can I'm truth saying, you're dare. saying dare? <laughs> All right, dare. Sevens for Abernathy. Dare, dare, dare. Re-raised to 450. I'm looking at Chris. I feel like we should do something with Chris. What did I do? <laughs> Don't involve me in your games. <laughs> You're here. Um, do you have a good idea? You know her. <laughs> she does. Huh. She do you know how many times she's like squeezed my breast? <laughs> I'm not making you do things like that. Call from Shahadi. 
used to get me in a lot of trouble in the past. That's perfect. Let's go. I'm, I'm, I'm giving you my it's your question. <laughs> Great play from Shahadi. Just let Abernathy continue to bet, but she decides not to this time. And again, Abernathy's just making all the right plays. Why didn't she continue to bet there? You know that's what Shahadi was hoping she was going to do, is bet again. Wait, this isn't fun. I have I barely won, and now if I win, I lose. Like, <laughs> that's what's fun about it. Losers are happy. What did you, I don't mean, dare. I don't even. It's a dare. It's a dare. It's a dare. Maybe I'm good at this game. Wait, wait, if you win this, do I get to truth or dare you? Okay. <laughs> well, I guess you could say Shahadi put Abernathy in checkmate. Speaking of checkmate, did you know Jennifer is a grandmaster in chess? More on that after this. Poker Night in America is being brought to you by 888poker.com, where the world plays online. Welcome back to Poker Night in America. Four of the worst chess players you have ever seen got together this morning and took on Jennifer Shahadi, one of the world's best chess players, and here's what happened. This one's called a horsey. Horsey. And this one's called Game of Thrones. Yeah, poker is really different. I guess the, uh, the big difference is there's so much psychology and uh, people skills, like reading people and kind of trying to exploit people. In chess, there's very, very limited exploitative strategies. I drew first blood, you see that? Yeah, good job. How did that feel? Awesome. What did you do? I took, I busted her chops. I took my horsey guy and took out her Your horsey guy. guy. I don't think yeah. it's horsey. These points coming in, the severe system is amazing. Got issues. You've got issues. I got serious issues. Wait, what are you looking at? You're looking at chess rules. Nope. You're like, chess, what you got there? I've, I've never played chess I before in my at? life. Oh, this I, is like I how to play. Even, literally, I've never played okay, chess. Okay, now I have a checkmate. Really? Yeah. Get him. You have Kill a checkmate? Him. No, no you don't want to be the first to lose. Yes. No one goes down. I so think that was under nine lose. moves, too. Yeah, take one of those big pieces and put it out there. Oh, wait, it's my move. <laughs> He's now. talking crap <laughs> over here. here. Now no, it's yeah, yeah. Take a big piece now I do it. have a checkmate. Do you want to try to find it? Uh-oh. I've got a checkmate. I can move my queen so that your king can't go anywhere. Well played, sirs. Ma'am? Yeah, good game. We're out of here. Check. Ah, pretty successful. So I got to move the queen right against the king. That's how you get You got to get right next to it? Yeah. So that way it's checked, but it needs to be protected by something so that it's checkmate. Checked by that. Yeah, exactly. He sees it. Okay. There we go. Uh-oh. Good game. Thank you. Check. Yeah, there it comes. And now I've got the mate, right? I think the better people get at poker, the more it kind of veers to becoming more like chess, because the better people get, the less you can exploit them, and then you have to just play more, like, theoretically. So I think poker's becoming more like chess every day. Poker Night in America at Sugar House here in Philadelphia is brought to you by 888 Poker, where the world plays online. 2550 are the blinds in our cash game. If you had to go to prison for 10 years or send your husband, which would you pick? Or send my husband? Yeah, <laughs> for a decade, which one? Oh no. Your choice. Or me or him? You are good. Yeah. to choose oh, either him or you that to go to brutal. prison for 10 years. Oh my God. Who is it? It's a great question. <laughs> this is brutal. <laughs> this is on TV. <laughs> send him. Yes. <laughs> nice job. Fair enough. Good answer. That's true. I believe you. I have my kids. <laughs> he does that, right? My kids are number one. Oh, he doesn't have kids with you. Oh, no, we have our own oh. kids together. <laughs> Kate Hall calls with pocket nines. Our kids, I'm sorry. I oh, my God. You're good. <laughs> You're good. That is a good one. That was a good She's one. She's good. Beth Shack will call out of the small blind. Shahadi folds. Flop is king high, and Kate Hall has the best hand with nines. Best Shaq made a pair of sixes on the flop. And everyone is checking to the river, and Christina Lindley hits her gutter ball. So she's gonna be in control. Beth Shack, first to act. She can get into trouble here. She's got two pair. 
Six hundred is the bet. Then they're gonna make sure she made that straight on the river. Checks her cards and thinks about the next option. I don't know why that option wouldn't be to raise. That's what she does to 2200. Let's see if Shaq will pay her off. She will not. She folds. And I don't know how Beth Shaq figured out that she was beat there, but she makes the right decision. Christina Lindley picks up a $4,200 pot. Whether that was a good fold or not, I think it was, but I don't know. Yeah, if you got there, I might have gotten there, too. Ladies' night from the city of brotherly love here in Philadelphia at Sugar House. Yeah, try having a baby at 39 years old. I wouldn't. There wouldn't be, like, a number. There wouldn't be a number. Like, when I, when I, as I've been dating men, and they would say, and they would say, you know, like, will you have another kid? There wouldn't be a number for me to start, have another kid, because it's my, it's like another 18 years of responsibility. A couple of spades on that flop for Beth Shack, and an up and down straight draw for Kate Hall. Other than chess, what would you do if you weren't playing oh. poker? Writing, I like that. I love writing. writing, yeah. For like books or everything, whatever. I like all of it, but it's hard. To, it's really hard to make money, and you have to do something else. It's kind of, it's like, well, chess is like that too. Yeah. I think it's great to do writing while you're doing other things, you know. So I just yeah. do like less of that and more of writing. Yeah. 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 I enjoy writing a lot too. I don't think I could do it for a living, but I really like it a lot. It's also one of those things where sometimes it's better if you don't only do that, because then you can be more selective, just like poker. Yeah, yeah. Pick you know, the games you, yeah. that appeal to you, yeah. Although it's like, I, I'm pretty physical, and like all the things I like the most are sedentary, so it's like I have to That's balance it. That's kind of funny, yeah. Interesting. I feel that I have to just like work out more than most people, because everything you like to do is in sitting. Yeah. <laughs> Although sometimes if you go to like a poker tournament, there's so much walking. You know, I feel like I'm always walking. Whenever I travel to like World Series or whatever, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I always lose weight in the series because of that, and because it's just the long hours of not having like real solid meals. Yeah, I, yeah. You forget to eat a lot when you play poker. I feel like it's weird. You'd think it would be the opposite. Yeah, I know. No, I do. Whenever I play like a lot of tournaments, <laughs> I typically I don't know, lose I feel a lot like of weight because I forget to eat. <laughs> I'm just like so many things. It makes you like anxious, and when you come back from you don't want to eat a big meal for yeah, dinner. Yeah, you feel like tired. Like, sure. Yeah. I usually eat like right after it's over. Like, oh, yeah, dinner you go break, home I'll, and like, then gorge <laughs> yeah, on yeah. your carrots. <laughs> You're like 1,300 calorie carrots. <laughs> If you start to like do weight training though, like I feel like you crave it if you don't do it for a couple days. It's almost like, <laughs> like wanting food or something, you know. Uh -huh. so Shaq is ahead and she's been betting every street. Let's see if she does it again. For a while and you stop doing it, like for, for like a week, it's just right. like I want to go to the bar. Both draws missed, but it was the betting from Beth Shaq that won her that hand. Way to lay on the pressure, Beth. Looks like it paid off for you. More tough decisions by our players when we return. DraftKings, the official fantasy sports site of Poker Night in America. Welcome back to Poker Night in America. Let's get back to the game. You got a $100 straddle on the button, that being Samantha Abernathy in the one seat. So we'll start with the small blind. What was it, Boyhood with just with Patricia Arquette? I yeah. love that. You really like that? But there was another one that I, I watched. Seen it yet. Another. Um, Is that a new movie? It's weird. It's oh, a little so slow, weird. but it's a really well-made film and, uh, like, incredible acting. Ends for Shaq. She just oh, called. There's another <laughs> great movie I guess that I just saw. I saw her hand, like, so it's a little I, bit... I, I, oh, you saw yeah. it. That's a little bit... I can't really call that. Grace? <laughs> I looked over to see if you were calling, and you lift your cards up, so I was like... Me? Uh, no, her. Oh. So then if I call behind, like... Yeah. After you see her hand, yeah. yeah. It's okay. I say that now, no. Do I save you, not save <laughs> you? I don't know. Yeah. No, you definitely. Yeah. Maybe not. I'm gonna need my cards back. <laughs> I 
and the beats just keep on coming. <laughs> Twenty-five bucks. Are you playing red and black or clubs? No, I have clubs. She has diamonds. Um, I'm glad you're paying attention. Yeah, I am. <laughs> She's like, yeah, I'm collecting this. <laughs> Pay up. <laughs> That's only the second time it's hit, though. It's about just seven hundred. Oh, yeah, no, every other time except for the one time that I paid you. Yeah. yeah. Or hearts. Yeah, yeah, the other suits. So we're one in one. You might get a call from Barber. Also with a gutter ball straight draw going to the turn. She does call. Yeah, hearts have actually hit more than anything. Mm -hmm. And nobody wanted it. That's Beth Shack's got Try. herself on a bit of a rush. Poker Night in America live streams are available at our website, pokernight.com, as well as unedited versions of our live streams. And we have another straddle on the button. This time it's Kate Hall. I'm just straddling every hand for the rest of the night. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get it going. Race. We should do around the straddle. Nancy Levin announces a raise from the small blind with Queen Jack. Yeah, you play a tournament next to a guy that everybody's calling every name in the book and you're like trying to concentrate on a tournament. That's not easy to do. Abernathy gets back in the action with King Jack suited. And now to Kate Hall who straddled on the button. Now why not with Queen Deuce suited? I'm gonna flop two pair. <laughs> That's my plan. I'm gonna flop on that, that straight. Forget two pair. I know, I know what, you are, what cards Except you have. that's not always good enough. <laughs> Especially there this you go. table. Boom, <laughs> Boom. <laughs> got it. Yeah, right. Got him. Boom. <laughs> ah. <laughs> she knew. Bill, is he still in? What? Is he still in? Oh, of course. Checks for everybody. Here comes the turn. Oh, really? Oh. Natasha. Soon. You know kitchens? Huh? You oh, know kitchens. kitchens? Yeah. No. Ten three. I don't know what that is. I thought you were cooler than that. <laughs> Very disappointed. I I might know the game, <laughs> not know the name. No, it's like an old uh it's very old. Line poker it's thing. Old, yeah. Uh, Abernathy calls. <laughs> I like how that qualifies as old school. It was like four years ago. It's like four years ago, yeah. it's so old school. <laughs> We we'll see Hall calling here. I think this is her opportunity to step out of the hand. But then again, what do I know? She's raising. She wants this pot. And let's see if she can get away with this. Well played, Kate Hall. Oh, and have a little of this as well on the side. Flop the pair. Turn the old 70 to club draw. Never folding. <laughs> she had your crush with the queen high. high. <laughs> if I can beat quad, it's on the river. Can't fold. It, nobody ever has implied odds against me. No, <laughs> you, you never have it. Yeah. It's like I'm drawing. Right. Like, why am I trying to get there against right. nothing? <laughs> That's always my favorite. When I like, I, I finally pill the set. They literally have queen high, and I'm like, I just wasted like all of that for nothing. <laughs> I check raise on the turn, and they snap fold. I'm like, why? Are you? <laughs> uh, there's Samantha Abernathy getting those good cards again. That's what she's used to playing here it's tonight. Problem. You never have it. It's like eleven calls on the button. Oh, and Jessica Dolly calls from her big blind. There's a hat in here too. It's pretty sweet. You want a drink? Yeah. Can I have a glass of Chardonnay, please? I have a Cabernet. Mm -hmm. a Cabernet. Chardonnay, Chardonnay. 275 from Abernathy. <sighs> what part in New York, Aaron? Oh. Try back up. 11 calls. Heads up. Do you like art? What? Do you like art? Yeah. Love. Really? I went to Art Basel this year for the first time. Wow. It was amazing. Where did you go? Art Basel. Oh, yeah. For the oh, first time. Really? It's Ever. really nice. 
Have you ever been to any of the air fires, like Venice or? Uh, no, I went to Art Basel in Miami. Miami, okay. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> we went separately but together. Oh. <laughs> he went with friends, I went with my boyfriend, but it was amazing. It was. You're into art as well? Yeah, I love art. Making it or enjoying? Both. Enjoying. Okay. Enjoying, Painting, like. everything, yeah. What's it like to have King Jack? Oh, two things. <laughs> uh, ooh, with a sweep. I know. I remember to pair five. We'll see how these ladies stack up when we return on Poker Night in America. Poker Night in America is being brought to you by 888poker.com, where the world plays online. This is like the tourniquet still behind. I think like the last hand. Wow. Literally. Wow. That's a good last wow. hand. Well, here's where we will finish Ladies' Night from Sugar House. Natasha Barber down 9K. Come back next time for more success. And on the winning side, yeah, it's really all about Samantha Abernathy. Although she did take a couple of steps back tonight, she still, from her Ladies' Night debut, will be booking a $13,000 win. For more from Poker Night, visit PokerNight.com or hook up with us on Twitch, Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube where you can see complete episodes and unedited live streams. Also, be sure to check out our online store for all your Poker Night merchandise. For everyone here at Poker Night, I'm Chris Hansen. Poker Night in America is brought to you by 888-POKER, where the world plays online, and by DraftKings. Wait, wait, if you win this, do I get to truth or dare you? <laughs> but I already said I have a crush on that uh, dealer that looks like Ken Reeves. Oh, you have a crush okay, on the dealer? No, no, I, I'm just, I was just giving an example of all the ways to get out of the question without actually incriminating yourself. I don't think you understand the truth. There's a lot of ways to wiggle out of it, but making up somebody is probably not okay. the spirit of truth <laughs> That's true. That's true.